The tragic explosion of the Space Shuttle Challenger occurred during its 10th launch on January 28, 1986, just 73 seconds after liftoff. It's something that's still talked about today, and if you remember the images, most agree they're images you'll never forget. This devastating event claimed the lives of all seven crew members and left an indelible mark on NASA's space program. But what were the final words of the crew? Before we explain prior to the tragedy, Challenger had a notable history. As the second shuttle to enter space in April 1983, it completed nine successful missions, marking significant milestones over nearly three years of service. Throughout its missions, the spacecraft accumulated a total of 62 days, 7 hours, 56 minutes, and 22 seconds in space, as reported by CBS. Among its achievements, Challenger facilitated the first spacewalk of the space shuttle program, and additionally carried the first American female astronaut astronaut and the first black astronaut, contributing to the diversification of space exploration. But, but the chilly morning of January 28, 1986 for the Challenger, the concern with temperatures dropping below freezing created concern among engineers. The concern regarding the solidity of the seals on the solid rocket boosters under such frigid conditions was something being talked about. The last recorded data of what the last words aboard the Challenger were chilling, since there may have been an inclination something had gone wrong. While the talk may have been little, some irregularities were noticed in instrument readings. At the 1 minute and 10 second mark, Scooby instructed Smith to throttle up. Just three seconds later, Smith's response was a distinct, uh-oh. Nothing was heard afterward. One of the saddest days in history. Where were you during that day? 